All right. Hello YouTube and welcome to my first video. I'm Panties, also known as Risky, and um, I'm here to proudly to present to you the uh, 3D FX Voodoo 2 that is able to uh, run on Windows 7. Yes, the latest operating system Windows 7 that somehow going to replace Windows Vista in the near future. Well now, um, right here I have the IBM PC and the computer specification is about 2.8 gigahertz and 512 Mac RAM. It runs on a 320 gigabyte of IDE and it is the uh, e-server, IBM e-server. I'm not sure if you guys uh, know about this. I just got this, uh, uh, this e-server a few days ago for just uh, 500 ringgit. Malaysia ring at 500 and it's quite cheap over here so um, comes with it together with the DVD writer and stuff like that but right now that's not what I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna show you now is uh, from this part 1 video my first YouTube video is uh, how is it gonna be possible to install uh, Voodoo 2 drivers into Windows 7 now as you can see I'm trying to start up Windows 7 okay this is a part 1 video you can get this uh, tutorial on how to install these uh, drivers, Voodoo 2 drivers from the uh, 3dfxzone.it www.3dfxzone.it Okay As you can see now, I'm running Windows 7 And uh, for those of you who knows the website, go to that website and uh, I'm gonna put the website onto my comments, so uh, just take a look at the comments Yes, so yeah, you saw this one, this is Windows 7, okay, inside this uh, operating system is running a 512 megabyte RAM, and yes, it is very smooth, for Windows 7 running on 512 megabyte RAM, is a lot, a lot of improvement since Windows Vista, okay, here we go, okay, basically it's loading some gadgets over here, I just freshly installed the uh, Voodoo 2, drivers that's why I have to reboot the computer okay I just also freshly installed the uh, northern antivirus here for Windows 7 or Windows Vista it works both since Windows 7 used the uh, Vista's technology or te technology or engine or something okay Alright, no. Okay, I also load these uh, virtual drive software from Stars Fastone. They give me the ability to run games without without having the original CD inside the drive. So I have to load them. They are very very useful for me. Okay. First off, here it is. This is the uh, settings here. Okay. Oops, sorry, wrong one. There we go. Now, what happens is uh, after you install Windows 7 and if you have two Voodoo 2 SLI cards, make sure you download the uh, uh, gr uh, the driver, the version 2.2.0 from the 3DFX zone. It here I show you now. Okay, see this one? This is the 3 d Zone 8. Now, you have to manually install it after you download the driver. Install only the secondary mismatch for both Voodoo 2 as I like in order to work. Do not install the uh, Voodoo 2 alone. It does not compatible with Windows 7. You have to use the SLI. Okay? So after you install this 2, you should be able to get it running and and then apply the registry fi registry fix from um, let me s let me get this website for you from Risky. He gave a registry fix over here. I'm gonna show it to you. Okay, open your web browser. Go to www.3dfxzone.it. Okay. This is a website that you can download all your Voodoo files. Alright. My next video will be showing you how does the game run 
on the uh, wound, uh, Windows 7. I only have two games. I'm going to show it to you shortly. Thank you.